Hi, I'm Dr. Robert Mather, and today I'm going to talk about the social psychological phenomenon of the mere exposure effect. Uh, the mere exposure effect basically is that the more you're exposed to something, the more you'll come to like it, uh, or the less you'll dislike it. I guess you could be moving that attitude from a, po from a negative to a less negative and more positive one in the absolute. Uh, one of the biggest researchers in this area was a man named Zayants, Z-A-J-O-N-C. Uh, it doesn't look like it's spelled, right? Uh, but Zayants as in science. Uh, but anyway, so, you know, Zayants and some others have done a lot of research. And they've done research when people are, are able to perceive things consciously and also when they're not able to perceive them consciously as in subliminal perception. And so um, you know, not all of the research I'm going to talk about here was Zayants' research, but um, in, the, in the superliminal or above the threshold of conscious awareness, uh, they've done studies on the mere exposure effect where they've had uh, in a large college classroom, they've had a, a female who works for the experimenter uh, come to class either, I don't know what the exact numbers were, but like 0, 5, 10, or 15 days um, out of the semester. And then they have everybody at the end of the semester rate um, the, the uh, photographs of a number of different um, individuals, including the ones that were coming to class on those days and not interacting with anybody, not participating in the class, just a large lecture class. And it, the, the data fell in line with exactly how often they came to class. So how often they were seen by the other students, there was a familiarity effect. Uh, where they rated them as being more attractive. Um, other studies below the, the threshold of conscious awareness have looked at uh, Chinese ideographs, so Chinese symbols, and presenting them so fast that people can't even perceive that they've seen the symbols. Uh, and people will rate the ones that they've seen um, subliminally as being more positive than the others. And of course, they have no idea. They're just looking at these symbols, and they're like, I don't know, five, 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 five. They're all the same to me. Oh, six for that one. Well, that's one of the ones you saw subliminally uh, multiple times. Uh, same thing with shapes. They've done subliminal presentations of shapes for people, uh, and, and the ones that people have seen subliminally, um, repeatedly, they will rate more positively than the others with no idea they've even seen shapes or anything that they're doing. So that's what's called the mere exposure effect. Uh, be careful of what you expose your brain to, because the more often you see it, uh, the more you're going to like it, or the less you're going to dislike it, the more familiar you become. Uh, thank you very much for checking out my, my video. Um, check out my other uh, videos on my YouTube channel. Thanks. <laughs>